Dear audience, welcome to your favorite channel, Moneybag, with your host, BNB. Today, we are discussing a very interesting topic, especially in Kenya. And uh, we want to discuss about the over 5,000 per annum return micro small businesses that are ignored by many Kenyans. My dear audience, there are many small micro businesses that are usually ignored by a large population seeking employment or source of earning a living. Most of young unemployed youth are seeking formal white collar employment which is not easy to come by nowadays and majority of these youths would rather work in a small establishment like M-Pesa outlets earning a minch salary of around Kenya shillings 10,000 per month than set up the micro small businesses that could earn them over that thousand per month with very little capital injection initially. In fact, based on our research, some of these businesses will require less than 5,000 Kenya shillings to start with a guaranteed return on investment of at least 1,000 Kenya shillings per day. This is a crazy return of over 5,000 per annum beyond majority of formal businesses. Furthermore, these micro small businesses can be a great launching pad for your entrepreneurship career. The advantages of micro small businesses are as follows. They require very little capital, hence very easy to start. High rate of returns is guaranteed. Very simple logistics needed to start. You may not need uh, premises. This is also a great opportunity for many youth to launch their entrepreneurship career without risking so much in relation to the initial investment. These micro small businesses can also help many youth to accumulate some tangible capital over a period of, of time. This can help the individuals to graduate to even better businesses in the future by accumulating knowledge and uh, savings. It is also a great opportunity to gain experience and build business acumen and opportunity to build future business network to help you launch yourself to the next level. So today, ladies and gentlemen, I will share a detailed analysis of an example of such a business to help you gain deeper understanding on this topic. Our sample micro small business is selling roasted or boiled maize. This option might sound funny to many people, yet it is a business with very high returns if you get location right. Just the other day, I engaged a miss seller in a certain town in Kenya and the guy told me that he was a university graduate, that he was not lucky to get a white collar job after campus. When things became very thick for him, he got an idea to set up a maize roasting business. His relatives and friends came to his rescue and helped him to fundraise startup capital of Kenya shillings 3,500. This helped him to get a jiko, some charcoal, and raw maize, and he started his business. He explained to me that his daily target is to sell at least 100 pieces of maize per day. At 20 shillings each, he is able to make sales of Kenya shillings 2,000 per day. He keeps aside Kenya shillings 700 as opening capital for the following day. That is for buying raw maize and charcoal. So by working for five hours each day, he manages to make a gross income of at least Kenya shillings, 1,300. By working for 30 days in a month, he is able to make a gross income 
of that 9,000, assuming logistic expense of around 10 shillings 300 per day, then the average net income earning per day is on the lower side, 1,000 Kenya shillings. Assuming even an initial capital of Kenya shillings 5,000 to buy a good jiko, chaco, matchbox, and raw maize at the beginning, then this guy will be getting a 20% return per day on invested capital. For that days, in a month, he is able to get a return of 600% on investment which is way above most of the formal businesses this in fact translates to an abnormal annual return of 7200 percent so ladies and gentlemen you should never ignore some of these small businesses you should always find a way of upgrading them and gain something from them. Other micro businesses in this category are making popcorns, selling samosas, selling mandazis, selling boiled eggs, selling smokies, and general hawking, among many others. We will be discussing more interesting topics in the next episodes. Keep following and subscribing to Moneyback channel, liking and sharing our videos. Thank you very much. Be blessed.